absolutely beautiful day over here. Loving the weather. Apparently we have really bad storms coming in tonight though, like tornado kind of storms. Uh, so we're gonna be keeping an eye on that today. We'll see how things progress. My pop and Nana are coming over for their weekly lunch today. Cannot wait to see them. Excited for a good meal because yum. So we'll show that to you. And more than anything, Addie is looking forward to playing with her Nana. She has some new toys that she wants to show her. So she cannot wait for Nana to get here and to have some playtime with her. Meanwhile, Avery's chilling, smiling. Jonathan's out in the building doing some work. And uh, we're looking forward to a great day. doctor that Addie's x-ray was clear that everything looked fine on her foot x-ray so I guess we just wait and see if it clears up they told us to come back if things are not better in a few days um so we'll just see we'll just see get some pretty good storms tonight but I don't think they're gonna be terribly bad hopefully just a lot of rain everything online keeps saying tornadoes <laughs> yeah well we live in an area that's subject to it but I don't think we'll get any tonight yeah we'll see I know I hope not either have faith in it as long as we don't lose any trees I'll be happy that's right <laughs> So guys, we are making the absolute most of our Easter leftovers today. So for dinner tonight, we're going to finish up our ham. Um, we have some biscuits. I believe we have some macaroni and cheese left. Maybe some deviled eggs, possibly. And we are going to make a cinnamon sugary apple bake. Okay. Now I am 100% just making this up. So no idea how it's going to turn out, but for some reason I've had it in my head for a few days and we are going to give it a try and take you guys along with us. We'll see how it turns out.
Okay, so I think the apples turned out pretty okay. And it was super simple. So I ended up using probably three apples, cut them super thin, put them in a glass pan, added a full stick of melted butter, and then I added some sugar, some brown sugar, some cinnamon, and I guess that was all, and mixed that all together. And then on top, I did some brown sugar crumbles and a little bit of flour, just to kind of thicken it up a little bit, and covered it up, baked it on 450 for probably like an hour and a half. And now the apples are super soft, smells delicious, and it should be fantastic. So, turned out pretty good. Oh, <laughs> I see things on Facebook all about it, but it is one of the worst feelings in the world when you are putting your kids to bed in their room, it's dark, their sound machines are on, and you're tired. I mean, you just feel like you're falling asleep. Then you gotta wake yourself up and keep going. <laughs> But the girls are in bed. It is the end of Tuesday. Guys, the apples were so good. So good. Um, so I know we talked about storms earlier. It's about nine o'clock, a little before nine o'clock maybe. No storms yet, not even any rain yet. So I need to talk to Jonathan and see what we're expecting for tonight. Um, but it's been a good day. Thank you guys for join us, joining us. It was a simple day. We've been at home all day, had leftovers. Easy peasy. Love good days like that, right? Um, super thankful to all of you who said you were praying for Addie with her little foot and hoping we can kind of figure out what's going on there. Hoping that in a day or two, she'll be cleared up and all better. Uh, but thank you guys so much for being concerned about her. And um, we appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. We love you guys and we will see you tomorrow. Now I lay me down to sleep. Me to sleep. I pray the Lord to my soul to keep. I don't do keep. keep me safe Keep me through the night, the night. and wake me with the morning.